What's up, people? Welcome to another Elden Ring guide. This quick guide will cover how you can find all five somber smithing bell bearings, and as a little bonus, I made sure to cut up the video so you can skip to the part you need with these. To find the first bell bearing, we can start in Kaelid at the heart of Aeonia side of Grace. From here, you can head east through the Scarlet to the Celia Crystal Tunnel. This one involves a light jog, but it's not too bad as long as you can get rid of the bugs. Now if this is your first time going through the cave, make sure to kick this ladder to unlock the shortcut, or you might regret that later. Behind this door is the enemy that drops the bell bearing. Once you have it, we can move on to the second. You'll start here at the forest spanning great bridge in Altus Plateau. We're going to start by jumping down the bridge, and at the bottom, you can head off the right side. Follow that around, you're going to reach a rock up here. You'll go to the left of it, and afterwards you can follow the right all the way up to the cave. Once again, you'll run into a boss door, but after this one, you'll have the second bell bearing. For the third bell bearing, the easiest starting point is the frozen lake in the snowy mountains. To get to the item, it's a quick 30 second jog on torrent to the bottom of the lake. You'll be able to see the church before the fog kicks in and the snow puppy says hi. So just head that way and you'll probably be okay. And right here, you'll find the third somber smithing item on a sleepy fellow. So it seemed the third bell bearing was too easy to find, so for the fourth, we're going to start out in Farah Missoula at the Tempest Facing Balcony, Side of Grace. You'll start your jog north, and uh, try not to trip over it as you approach. For the fifth bell bearing, we start here at the Dragon Temple Balcony. Since the third and fourth somber smithing bells were too easy to get, I'm guessing From Software decided to compensate for it a little bit. You can start by dropping off this ledge and dodging the red lightning, as well as the birds with blades welded to their feet. Make sure to hit that jump and don't fall through. You're going to run to the right here, pass that dragon, and hook a right around this corner. So once you get up here, you're going to cross this and enter a room. Make sure to clear out all the enemies, and the item is right behind this guy on a body. Something bad is about to happen to me. Make sure to clear out all the enemies, and... Guys, thanks a bunch if you made it this far. A like or follow is free, and it's a great way to passively support content creators like myself. If you want to get regular smithing stones, I have a great guide for that as well that I'll link in the top right corner for you to check out. Until next time.